Yeah, I, that, that, I kept seeing like these huge geez. sets and it's what rising swell, so you're really worried. Like, you're always thinking, like, what's behind this? What time we so we kept paddling a little too far out, and I finally just held ground on one. Just you're like odd. battling your instincts, you want to just paddle out to sea, but so I just sat it. for a little longer than most people. And then that set popped up, and I just whipped it early, and I just committed. And I think most guys were a little too far out. And then it just stood up, and I got in smooth, but then I seen this huge step coming, and I knew I was going to eat shit, like, first thing, but I was like, I tried to knife it, and I was like, maybe, maybe I can, like, make the air drop not as dramatic, but I still launched, like, a few feet, and just, I tomahawked, like, three times, and went over the falls, and pulled my vest, and I didn't come up for a while, I just went really far. You know, surprised like tweakers super didn't violent, violent shake-up. Came up, Colomano was going to grab me, but there's like a 30-footer behind him. And he just said sorry. And just, he had to bail because the wave was already like eating the ski. And I got smoked on that one too. And then, and then I got picked up. And then, uh, yeah, I was like puking, puking water and shit. And I was just like slapped my face super hard in the water. And I was like pretty shooken. But, I mean, still Bobby. kicking and going to give it another try. I had decided to go get reacquainted with Mavericks. Flew over there on a Thursday night red eye. Landed at 4.30 in the morning and then went out there and surfed for a chunk of the day and had fun. Had a good session. Felt a new board and got a few waves and an ice bath. And then I saw the forecast changed a little bit for the better here and the worse there and then I booked a last minute flight to be on hold for the next day in case it was completely canceled and then Saturday I woke up, skitched out a little more and then jumped on a earlier flight in the morning and uh, yeah, landed here yesterday at 3.30 in the afternoon. Here we are at 6.15 at Malika. So, yeah, it was, a lot of moving, but like Shane said, we've been doing that for a long time now.